What's up guys, it's Mikey and today I'm going to show you how to record your Xbox One gameplay without a capture card. So the first thing you need is a computer, obviously, <laughs> with Windows 10, that's important, it has to have Windows 10. And you can use either, I use OBS or Bandicam, depending on what I'm doing. So I'll show you how to do it with OBS. You want to launch OBS first before you launch the Xbox app. So launch OBS and then launch the Xbox app on Windows 10. You have to have your Xbox is on. And then you connect to your Xbox and stream it to Windows 10. And this is the way that you record all the gameplay. You'll want to have your console hardwired in, and it's best if your computer is also hardwired in. I'm only wired in on my console, and then my laptop is wireless. It's on the 5 gigahertz network, so it, it works pretty good, and we have decent uh, upload speeds, so it works pretty well. So then you got the stream into your computer, and you add the source game capture, and the mode go the drop down menu and click capture specific window and then click on Xbox app and then I'm using uh, multi displays so multi adapter compatibility and I don't want to capture the cursor and once I do the multi adapter compatibility it shows up there so you click OK and then there you go you got your console in OBS And you just hit start recording. And now OBS is recording all your Xbox gameplay without a capture card. And if you want to use Bandicam, uh, with Bandicam it doesn't matter if you start streaming first. You just open up Bandicam. have that full screened and then you make sure that you see in the Bandicam window that it shows the Xbox app in the top corner at 1080 1920 by 1080 and then you just hit your hotkey to start recording and you'll see it in the corner because uh, Bandicam it goes red when it starts recording so you'll see down there it's recording you're getting all your game see the better the internet connection the better your your recordings are going to be the smoother it'll be. Every now and then it'll glitch out on me. But for the most part, when I'm not doing anything else, just this, it works pretty good. You want to have both wired in though. That's, that's the way it'll work the best. So that's a simple way to record your Xbox One without a capture card. So if this video helped you out, just uh, leave a comment or give the video a like and subscribe for more content. Thank you for watching.